and Führung is one of my favorite uh, Mozart operas from all of them. It has this very youthfulness and this crispiness, but it's also emotionally very deep. Because of that you can peel layers and layers of very interesting new things to find out and a lot of depths, yeah, so it's fantastic music. There are some pieces and some music that after conducting it you feel very exhausted, you know, you've, you left out a lot of yourself in order to get uh, to the end of the piece, yeah? But this music, just from the first note, even if you start a little bit uh, tired, it just lifts you up. I, I don't know, it's magical. <laughs> it's, it's, so, yeah, it just fills your batteries, so to say, yeah. For this production, Luc Perceval wanted to demonstrate how the serai can be imprisoned in our cells. So he chose to keep some characters from the original story. And then he went to um, get some text and chose some parts of the text from Asli Erdogan, a Turkish author, who wrote about depression, about loneliness, but also about love, and put the text in relationship with the music. And the way this is done on stage is that um, the actors are on stage saying the text of Asli Erdogan. <laughs> They are the same characters as the singers, but they're a bit, bit more mature in the life experience. They address their younger selves sometimes, and then their younger selves kind of sings the emotion out of what has been said in the text. I think the center of the world of the Entführung of saint Serai by Luc Perceval is the church, where the people can just go inside themselves and hear themselves talk. And this people, also the, the life that is around this church, so the life on the streets is also portrayed, it's also present, so it's as if this production kind of took a whole society and then decided we're going to go inside this person and we're going to go inside this person and we're going to go zoom in. that makes it absolutely rich because it could be anyone on stage that we see. I love this production. <laughs> <laughs>